So when it comes to making money online, I've personally been able to successfully do it in a number of different ways. And all of these different ways of making money online, I'm currently using various different apps and websites. And I've actually been able to get to the point of quitting my full-time job, traveling around the world to various different amazing locations, while still being able to earn a source of income from all of these different online businesses. So I thought, you know what, today, let me make a video where I break down 10 of my top recommended apps and softwares that I believe every single beginner should look into, especially if you're at the start of your online business journey. By the end of this video, you're gonna know exactly which side hustle is the best one for you to potentially start. And you're also gonna know exactly which app or website you definitely need to be using. All right, so jumping straight into the first one, which is AutoDS. Now, if you're someone that's considering to start a dropshipping store, then AutoDS is something that you should definitely look into because it's gonna be able to help you with so many things. Because for example, once you've created your account, which you're gonna be able to do by clicking the 30 day trial link in my description, you're gonna be able to log in just like this. And one of the first features that I'm gonna show you is the fact that you can see all of these different winning products. And because AutoDS is a software that dropshippers all around the world are using, they're going to know exactly which products are doing well and which ones aren't. So you're gonna be able to scroll through this page over here and take a look at all of these different items. In addition to that, you're also gonna be able to spy on which TikToks are currently doing well. And from here, you're gonna be able to find products as well. But when it comes to finding a winning product on AutoDS, I would say that one of the best features is that you're gonna be able to click into any one of these different products that you're thinking about selling. So for example, let's say if I was thinking about selling this item over here, I'm gonna be able to click into it just like this. And then from here, I'm gonna be able to get so much useful information. For example, what's my potential profit going to be? How much should I sell the item for? And I'm also gonna be able to see sellers that are currently selling the product right now. So I'm gonna be able to click into their store and see exactly how they structured it and how I'm gonna be able to better them in terms of the design and just the way that they've structured their entire website. But of course, one of the best features of AutoDS is that you're not necessarily gonna to have to manually ship out the orders yourself because you're gonna be able to use their auto fulfillment feature, which is where they're going to automatically ship out your orders because you're gonna be able to connect your Shopify store to your AutoDS account, as well as connect it to your supplier. So everything is gonna be automated. But this now brings me on to one of the second apps that I would recommend that you guys use, which is Helium 10. Now Helium 10 is an Amazon product research tool. So if you're thinking about selling on Amazon, then this is definitely the tool that you need to sign up to. But at the same time, you're gonna be able to use it when it comes to generally finding winning products to sell because of course, Amazon is the number one most visited e-commerce platform in the entire world. So if you're able to find a winning product that's doing well on Amazon, you're gonna be able to essentially sell it on any platform. But to give you an idea of exactly how it works, once you've created your Helium 10 account, which again, you're gonna be able to do by clicking the link in my description, it's gonna take you to this page over here, which is the black box product research section. But from here, when it comes to finding the best products or the best niche to build your business around, you're gonna click on niche over here. And let's assume that I was thinking about maybe building a pet business and I wanted to see exactly how well it was doing on Amazon. I'm gonna be able to simply type in pet over here. And then from here, it's gonna show me so much useful information. Like for example, as you can see, the total revenue for the pet niche on amazon.com is over $26 million. And I can also see that the average revenue across all of the different sellers is over $280,000. So using this tool, it just kind of clarifies whether or not I'm looking at the right niche or not. And of course, if I scroll down, it's gonna show me some of the best products within this niche. Now, my recommendation when it comes to selling any physical product business is to focus on selling small lightweight items because it's gonna save you money when it comes to you shipping it to your customer and you're gonna be able to, of course, make more profit. So for example, there's this item over here, which is a product that I've never heard of before. It's a dog training clicker. As you can see, Helium 10 is able to show us that it's a small standard sized item. And we can also see that the sales have increased by 22% over the last 90 days. But this now brings me on to the third website that I'm gonna talk about, which is a website that helped me get to my first $1 million online, which is Alibaba.com. Now, Alibaba.com is a 
good website to go on to when it comes to finding suppliers that are based in China. To my knowledge, anyone can sign up to it today. You're going to be able to log into your account and search for any product that you're thinking about selling. So let's assume that I wanted to sell this exact same product because of course, this seller has been able to generate over $72,000. All I'm simply going to do is search for it by pasting the name of it in there just like that and then clicking on search. And as you can see, there's all of these different suppliers that are based in China that pop up. And of course, from this point, I'm gonna have to scroll through and find the supplier that I wanna use. So for example, there's this supplier over here, which is offering the exact same item that on Amazon that this seller was able to again make over $70,000 from. And as you can see, it's only going to cost me if I wanted to buy it from the supplier up to 62 cents. However, the seller on Amazon is selling it for around $4.99. And of course, this was just a quick example, just to illustrate exactly how you can go from not knowing what product to sell to eventually finding a supplier that's gonna be able to source it for you. But this now brings me on to the next app that I use when it comes to making money, which is an investing app called Trading212. Now, the way that I use it, as you guys can see over here, I've just logged into my Trading212 account. I mainly use it when it comes to investing into the stock market, specifically into index funds, e.g. the S&P 500. As you can see over here, I've got around 24,000 pounds invested into this particular portfolio, and I've been able to get back a profit of over 2,700 pounds. So of course, with this app, you are going to need to have money for you to be able to make money, but I'll definitely advise you guys to look into investing into things like the S&P 500 because it's a great way for you to put your money to work. And one of the good things about using Trading212 when it comes to investing is that, of course, you're going to be able to earn dividends and you're going to be able to earn profits when you invest like this. But if you use the link in my description down below, you're going to be able to get a free share once you top up a certain amount. And this is a similar thing with the next app that I want to show you guys. This one's also an investing app as well, but this is what I use when it comes to investing my business profits or just some business money that I have lying around into the stock market. So Trading212 is what I use for personal funds and this app called Invest Engine is what I use for business funds. So this way I'm able to invest my business profits put it to work so that it's not just sitting in the bank catching dust. And the concept of being able to invest business profits into the stock market is something that I recently found out about. And that's the reason why I'm sharing it with you guys over here. So Invest Engine is one of the portfolios that I use when it comes to investing my business profits. There's some other ones that I use as well, but I do the exact same thing. I mainly invest into the S&P 500 and some other index funds, as you can see on the screen over here. Now, bear in mind that this is a brand new portfolio that I started building up maybe in the last couple of weeks or so, but so far it's been efficient and I'll definitely recommend it. So if you did want to sign up to them, you're also going to be able to get a free share as well if you use the link in my description. And of course, there's a lot that goes into investing and I'm not a financial advisor, but if you did want me to make a detailed video breaking down exactly what you need to do when it comes to investing your personal funds, as well as your business funds, then put in the comments down below, do the investing video and I'll get onto it ASAP. But swiftly moving on to one of the next softwares that I want to show you guys that I'm personally using with all of the different YouTube channels that I'm building up, which is vidIQ. Now vidIQ has so many different features and whether you're thinking about starting a faceless channel or you're thinking about starting a channel where you're showing your face on camera, it's going to be able to help you because for example, let's say if I was considering to start a brand new faceless YouTube channel right now that was centered around the law of attraction and I wanted to have an idea of which video is going to be the best one for me to make, I'm going to be able to come over here to the keyword section and type in the video that I have in mind. So for example, let's say if I'm thinking about making a video that is about manifesting a lot of money fast, I'm going to be able to type in that title just like that, click on enter and it's going to be able to show me that the search volume is medium and the competition is also medium. So this isn't necessarily bad, but let me type in this title over here, Law of Attraction Success Story. If I just search for that, as you guys can see with this one, the search volume is medium, but the competition is low. So my chances of being able to rank a video on YouTube with this title is slightly higher. And again, this is just one of the many tools that vidIQ has, but 
this now brings me on to one of the next softwares or apps that I'm going to talk about, which is InVideo AI. So sticking with the same example in terms of if I wanted to start a faceless YouTube channel around the law of attraction, now that I know that this is a video that doesn't have too much competition, I'm going to be able to go over to my InVideo AI account. And by the way, for those of you that don't know exactly what InVideo AI is and how it works, you're going to be able to simply type in a prompt into this box over here. And the more details that you give it, the better video it's going to be able to make for you. And it's going to be able to fully produce a video from start to finish for you in terms of the editing, the voiceover and everything like that. So for example, I'm going to be able to type in a prompt, something along the lines of make a video about a real law of attraction success story that involves someone manifesting money and going from broke to rich. And then all I need to do is just click on generate a video. And just like that, within about two minutes or so, it came back with this fully edited video that of course I'm going to be able to make any changes that I want to it by simply clicking on edit over here. But I'm just going to quickly play it just so that you guys have an example of the standard and the quality of videos that you're going to be able to go away and make yourself. Have you ever wondered about the true power of the mind and how it can transform reality? Can a thought, a wish or a dream turn into a tangible, touchable, wealth-filled reality? Today, we delve into the incredible world of the law of attraction. So as you heard and as you just saw, this video is pretty decent and the voiceover is really good, it's really realistic, even though all of this was generated with AI. So if you are thinking about starting a faceless YouTube channel, this is definitely one of the softwares that you want to check out. But when it comes to making money with a YouTube channel, there's so many different ways as you guys can imagine, but I would say that one of the most popular ways is with Google AdSense. Whenever you see one of those ads that you have to wait five seconds to skip being played, just know that the person that owns the channel is earning a portion of that ad revenue. And AdSense is definitely great when it comes to making money, but at the same time, as a beginner, you're gonna have to wait until you meet a certain threshold, which I believe is around 3,000 watch hours and 500 subscribers. That's why I always recommend people to look into alternative methods when it comes to making money with a YouTube channel and one of the most popular ones is with affiliate marketing. And this now brings me on to the next website that I want to talk about, which is impact.com. So as you can see, I've just logged into my impact.com account and it's essentially an affiliate network that's going to allow you to apply to all of these different companies. There's so many different companies here that you've probably not heard of and there's companies that you probably have heard of. For example, there's companies like Upwork, you're gonna be able to sign up to them, Coinbase, all of these companies that you're probably using on a daily basis. So by signing up to something like impact.com, you're then gonna be able to apply to any one of these, get your affiliate link and put it in your YouTube videos from day one, which is gonna help you start earning money from your channel from day one as well. And this is a similar thing with the next website that I'm gonna talk about, which is partnerstack.com. Now Partnerstack is also an affiliate marketplace where you're gonna be able to see all of these different companies that you can sign up to. But I would say that the main difference between Partnerstack and the rest of the affiliate networks out there is that they mainly focus on softwares. So if you was thinking about starting a faceless YouTube channel that maybe had something to do with finance, tech, softwares, or just anything in that realm, then you're going to be able to go onto Partnerstack and find a suitable software that you're going to be able to promote. And the good thing about softwares is that they tend to pay really decent commissions because as you can see over here, there's various different softwares that are going to pay out 30% lifetime commissions, even as high as 50% commissions. So this is definitely another website that I would advise you guys to check out if you wanna be able to earn a passive source of income when it comes to becoming an affiliate for any one of these different softwares. But this now brings me on to the final website that I wanna share with you guys that has been super beneficial to myself and I know it's gonna help you guys out too, which is Teachable. Now Teachable is a platform that I use when it comes to selling various different digital products on the internet in so many different ways. Like for example, if we just check out their website over here, these are the different types of digital products that you're gonna be able to sell using Teachable. For example, design files, eBooks, spreadsheets, how-to guides, email templates. There's so many different types of digital products that you're gonna be able to sell 
on the internet in so many different ways. And of course, as we know, when it comes to selling a digital product, the profit margin is a lot more higher compared to a physical product. So by building your own digital product and hosting it on Teachable, it can definitely be a great way for you to make a passive source of income. And of course, there's an entire step-by-step -step process that you need to follow when it comes to building a digital product, selling it on Teachable, and being able to get to your first $1,000 in profit. And I actually recently made a video where I break down all of the most important things that I wish I knew before I started selling digital products and the things that helped me go from zero to over $100,000 in pure profit. So if you want to check that out, I'm going to leave the video over here. Make sure you watch that straight after this because it's already helped out so many people. And if you also wanted to sign up to my free email newsletter where every single week, I'm going to send you an email to help you on your money making journey, whether it's an email about affiliate marketing, drop shipping, selling on Amazon, selling digital products, whatever the case is, you're going to receive a valuable email from myself every week to help you when it comes to making money online. So you're going to be able to sign up to that again for completely free by clicking the first link in the description down below. Don't forget to press the like button if you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe as well. Hit the bell notification. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next one. Make sure you stay safe out there. Peace.